Hi single Libra people. This is your love tarot cards reading for the month of September 2021. Four cards on the table at first and then from there. Right, four cards Libra, seven of swords, five of wands, justice, and oh, two of cups and five of cups. All right. Eight of cups, your influencing energy. Right. Okay, I'm going to comment on it just now. So, seven of swords, now paired with the Hierophant. Five of wands with the tower. Justice with justice. Beautiful. Now, five of cups, two of cups with seven of cups. Three of wands. Perhaps relocating, okay? Looking to leave behind something that was looking forward to something that you have in your mind that you have started already. That's your August, okay? Begin and end, interacting, you know, here with these two energies. You are closing down, you are finishing something in your life place of work, place of residence, some situation, you are leaving it behind to move forward somewhere there, somewhere overseas, somewhere in another city, in another country, um, another another line of work, another career. You see what I'm saying? With the three of wands, something else, something else. Being single for a very long time, you don't want to be that anymore opening up you know to be available for the relationship could also be something like that um, these two energies somewhere from august definitely old and new leaving behind the old going forward for the new expecting something new for yourself very much present um, somewhere in august and perhaps you are inheriting that sort of energy for the september for this month as well now, Seven of Swords with Hierophant. Now, you do have quite a few majors in here. Look, the Hierophant, the Tower, uh, Justice. Beautiful Justice. I love this third week of September. Now, the Hierophant is within you. There is, that's, that's faith, okay? There is unity that is believing in something. But look, Seven of Swords is a bit tricky energy. Sometimes this energy lies. Sometimes this energy benefits out of somebody else's work benefits out of something which is not really which is not really belonging to this person to you or to another stealing that thief as well my impression here is that you are benefiting something based on another one's success or connections or something like that there's another person that you are just tied together with okay that person is successful businessman and you are a good friend with that person and that one will pull you. Whatever business now that person is making is you or with. You will be benefiting now just because you are connected with that person. You see what I'm saying? Could also be that somebody does have some sort of misfortunate situation, okay? Something happened to your boss. I don't know, some something misfortunate and it has to go to early pension, okay? Early retirement and you are upgraded. Otherwise, you wouldn't be if that misfortune didn't happen to that person. You see what I'm saying? That kind of energy, that sort of benefit, in a way, considering yourself, yourself lucky, in a way, because you know this person, because that happened down there, and you are, you know, benefiting somehow. But you do have faith, uh, of course. This energy is important for you. I love these energies, even this tower, in a way. That faith is very important in that what is coming, in that what you are doing, in that, that way you are heading. You are heading towards something else. You are leaving behind something unpleasant. This is a war zone behind this person that you didn't enjoy anymore. Something behind, something that you are leaving behind, that way you were, okay? Till, till August, perhaps, okay? You didn't enjoy anymore. It was conflicting. It wasn't pleasure for you anymore and you are moving forward towards something else and I really believe that it started somewhere this idea started 
started somewhere in August and the movement is happening now. First week of September, you are moving forward. Doesn't matter way, you will consider yourself lucky in a way. It's not going to be all your achievement, all your success, all your hard work. There will be something that you are benefiting and it's not all your hard work, which doesn't, doesn't mean that it's something morally or ethically problematic. It doesn't mean at all. It could be just a just just consequence of your values, of your knowledge. You see what I'm saying? People want to work with you. Somebody is taking you with. It doesn't, it means nothing bad. You are very faithful. You do believe that that new place, that where you are heading from now on, from this beginning of September, even maybe from earlier, from August, is place for you, will bring that what you want for yourself. This is believing, having faith, being firmly on the ground, okay, with it. Tower follows, okay, after five of cups, seven of swords, tower follows within you. And I said to you, I kind of like it within you. It is to break down that what was false, that what you didn't like anymore, that what was war zone for you, conflicting situation, something second best, that what you couldn't, couldn't stay in anymore. Residence, home, uh, town, workplace, country, doesn't matter. Situation, you couldn't take it anymore. It was, it, there was nothing else for you there. You just wanted to go quietly, not confrontation, nothing. You wanted to deconstruct it, completely deconstruct it for yourself to begin, to start beginning something new. And you will be beginning something new. Um, so far, I don't see a relationship in here. I don't see another person in here. I really see some sort of change in your life, Libra. And it is a significant change. Maybe you are leaving your home, so you will be meeting other people, but this is big change for you, um, a Libra person. Um, five of Wands is that first chaos, okay? After deconstructing something old, something that lasted, eight of cups, something that lasted, that this was something solid, eight cups there, you were in that past situation for quite some time, the tower you don't build for a day, it is belief, it is a something, relationship, marriage, that lasted, okay, relationship, these two are suggesting a relationship, something that lasted for a very long time, you are deconstructing, idea about relationship, a be idea about what do you want from your relationship, from another person. That is deconstructing and moment of chaos is there. What from there? Plenty ideas, plenty, plenty things to do, plenty things to attend. And you are, perhaps second week of September, you are chaotic on yourself, Libra. Things are, you know, whatever comes first, that's what you do, that's what you catch, you know. And it's, you know, from the head and from the tail, just catch it somehow, put it together until you achieve some sort of harmony, until you put the base for the new tower, for the new building, for new relationship. You see what I'm saying? This is kind of breaking the idea about your old life with relationship in it or not, okay, and going into something else. I'm kind of really feeling that it is about Libra, your life, not just a relationship, something more meaningful, more wider is here. There's your energy, justice, Libra energy, karmic decision, karmic moment, making and breaking point for you, decision that will last, that will not get back into old. Never. This decision will prevent you from going back into old. Never again. From now on, you are moving forward into something else. Your energy, balanced energy, karmic decision, never never again. That's what it was. Just something new. And it is new. Two of Cups, there is relationship, you know, it, it's not it's not relationship, this is possibility for the relationship, there is another person, I better say like that, okay? 
another person. With two of cups, we do talk about another person. And there is two cups standing behind this five of cups. It seems to me the same time when you meet another person, you will be very sad thinking about your failures. What did you have? Something sad that you did have. I mean, you wouldn't break up if it was good. You wouldn't turn your back if it was good. Something lately wasn't really nice for you. And you were last week of September, you were thinking about it. You were kind of reminiscing that what happened. You are having maybe remorse. Maybe you feel guilty. Um, what you have done, what you have said, maybe you should have done better. Maybe you, I don't know, you are thinking about that failure, you are analyzing it, you are feeling sad, uh, depressed even with this energy, but at the same time, you do have two cups, you do have another person, okay? It seems to me, it's moment when you met another, and this beautiful relationship seems very nice. These people are all in, in, in balance and harmony together here. Very healthy relationship that you have. It's not perhaps a love relationship, it's not committed relationship, it's just new things that you have, new things that you have with another, but seems very balanced and harmonious and nice. At that point, you have have to reminisce that what it was. You have to just see, go through everything that was, why it was like that, why it happened like that, what was your fault in it, just in order to wave it goodbye and never to be there again. You see what I'm saying with this five of cups and two of cups? Most important is this two of cups that is standing here, this person that you met last week of September, beautiful, beautiful last week of September, you will have great ideas, great optimism about what it could be. You will not, with this seven of cups and two of cups, you will not be kind of in the mood to think, uh, love relationship, soulmate, you will have your options, okay? You're not gonna rush into, oh, this is my soulmate, immediately I'll get married, you know, this is right one and only one. No, you're not gonna be in that state of mind at all. Um, you will be optimistic, definitely, it seems you will pay attention, you will like that person, but you will have in mind past failures, okay? All the time you are having in mind past failures. While you having this beautiful moment with another person, harmonious, balanced moment, you will keep your options open for yourself, okay? You're not gonna say anything for certain. There is, there is no commitment on your side from your, from your Libra, not at this point, not in September, that's for sure. Promising person that you are meeting, lovely one, you will feel good with this person, but being that you did have experience, okay, very unfortunate experience, you will not rush, you will not commit, you will keep your options open, for yourself, everything is possible with this one. So no committed relationship, falling in love forever, living happily ever after or something. Nothing like that. You will keep your options open for yourself. Uh, Libra, but otherwise quite significant, really felt significant September for you, particularly third week of September, you will have that decision. Even before that, this is all majors within you in September, you are breaking down with something old, perhaps definitely started in August. This is not something new, new September, no. That started in August and you are just implementing it, you are doing it. That what was idea, that what you have started that what you contemplated about and began, you know, you did put together something in August, you are implementing it this time. By third week of September, you'll have your decision. My impression, as I said, it's about your life and your relationship, perhaps that possibility to change your single status is there, okay, but you are not rushing. You did have bad experiences, so no rush. You are very cautious in here. Plenty options that you have for yourself, so no rush. Anyway, Libra, enjoy it.